good evening in this video we'll discuss about aggregator transformation it is a, a transformation object It belongs to active type. It is used to perform calculations. Just like an expression here also we can do the calculations. A column based calculations or row based calculations we can do. But not only simple calculations, if you need aggregations, that is also possible. It supports to perform aggregations with the help of aggregator functions like max, min, sum, average, etc. We are able to use this aggregator functions because it is providing group type behavior for the ports. So the ports type in this transformation if you observe it is supports input type output type variable type group type so totally like four types of behaviors are there input output variable group and because of this group type behavior we can implement the aggregate functions if it doesn't select the group type behavior then you basically that max and min it is only for the part complete uh, it is not 100% aggregation so only for the particular thing you can implement and if it doesn't use any aggregator functions and if it doesn't use group by then it is like a simple calculations like an expression so it is in a, uh, some extra work we are doing when compared to expression transformation here so we'll try to take a simple example So we are having a source table called as an src underscore emp with this data with various department numbers are there like for example select a star from src underscore emp order by department number now here for department 10 we are having three records are there for department 20 we are having a set of records for department 30 you run set of records now my requirement is I want to know what is the maximum salary for that particular department what is minimum salary for that particular department what is an average salary for that particular department and what is total salary of that particular department this data I want put into the target table. So this is my target table tgt underscore dpt underscore sal so for that particular department what is the maximum salary average salary minimum salary and total salary so i want to know about these particular values <coughs> so we'll try to design the mapping for this already source table is available but target table is not there so we'll try to import the metadata so I'm going with the target designer 
targets menu import from database connected to the target system by specifying the target connect connection and username and password. So, digit underscore dpt underscore sal. This is my target table. Click on OK. So, we got the table. We will go with mapping. Mappings menu create m underscore aggregator. Click on OK. Drag the source table srs underscore emp. Then transformation menu create select aggregator provide some name for example agr click on create and done then drag department number and the salary only the two ports I'm trying to take here now I'll add the extra ports what we need the calculation all the ports will try to add here double click on this aggregator go to the ports tab add a new port for example I'll say max cell data type I'll take it as a decimal uncheck the input port and write the formula so what is the formula means I'll say max of cell validate ok ok so I'm asking to calculate the maximum salary so if you say like this it is with respect of complete data but I need with respect of department so place the check mark for group by option select the group by option for department number so now it becomes like salary maximum salary for each department if it doesn't select it it is for the complete data now I'll add one more port for example avg sal data type is decimal uncheck the input port and write the formula as avg of sal validate success is validated so click on ok click on ok similarly add one more port called as min cell data type is decimal uncheck the input port and provide the expression as min of cell click on validate click on ok same way add one more port called as total salary total salary or higher total what is the total salary expenditure something like that I'm taking as a decimal uncheck the input port and write the formula so what is the expenditure means it is nothing but sum of all salaries click on validate click on ok click on ok now all these four calculations max of cell average of cell minimum cell and total cell I am trying to do for each department there is a reason I selected group by for particular department number click on ok and then take your target table so what is the target table teach it underscore dpt underscore sal and map the ports department number next max cell average cell minimum cell and total cell save the mapping open the workflow manager create a new workflow wf underscore 
aggregator click on ok then create the session task tasks menu create select a session provide the session name so provide the session name that is s underscore aggregator click on create for the mapping called as an m underscore aggregator click on ok click on done then link these two objects that is tasks menu link task from start to the aggregator then repository menu save it and then execute it so truncate table tgt underscore dpt underscore sal select star from tgt underscore dpt underscore sal it is saying no rows it doesn't have any data now we will try to execute the workflow workflows menu start workflow but the workflow monitor it's showing as running but it doesn't give any connection so it's showing me as in failed so come back to the workflow double click on the session object go to the mapping tab source qualifier connection is rc source but target connection is also rc source is there but actually it is present in the target system so we need to change it so change this as rc underscore target normal mode click on ok and then save it and then execute it so if you observe the database table the target table is empty it doesn't have any data so we'll execute the workflow workflows menu start workflow if you go to the workflow monitor it is showing as a running procedure succeeded now come back to the database check the table once select star from tgt underscore dpt underscore cell now if you take department 10 there are three records under the source so what is the maximum means it is 5000 that's what you got as an output for department 10 max is 5000 what is the minimum salary and the selected data on left side means it's showing me 1300 so that's what it showed me 1300 even on this output total salary is 8,750 and average is 2,916 points some value so like this for each department it is able to find out what is the maximum salary minimum salary average salary and total salary so it is about the aggregator we can use the aggregate transformation in this particular format